Creek Police Department is reminding you to make sure you lock your car doors as people continue to open cars in the middle of the night and steal things from inside. News 2's Berkeley County reporter Raymond Owen speaks to one homeowner who says he's frustrated. Several cars have been targeted here in the Crowfield Plantation community in Goose Creek. And uh, they're not just breaking into cars, some of the cars are just unlocked and thieves are opening them up and taking what they want. We have gangs of kids um, going through the neighborhoods, walking um, by car doors, looking for open cars, and then taking possessions out of the vehicles. You can see numerous security videos online of people walking around at night looking inside other folks' cars. A few years ago, Corson says he and his neighbors were victims. As it has happened more recently, Corson has decided to increase his security. Exterior cameras, which I have to get put up, which basically have a light that goes off and then I can um, play off a siren if I want to. Um, it's just more expensive equipment. Never thought would be needed, but in today's time and day and age, it's very necessary. The bottom line, don't leave valuables in your car and make sure your car is locked. In Goose Creek, I'm Raymond Owens. Count on two. The James Island community is also suffering from episodes of car break-ins. Residents brought the attention to police there. At National Night Out tonight, the James Island Neighborhood Council will be on hand to sign people up for neighborhood watch programs.